you know, I had a dream last night that I won the lottery. My dad said, what are you going to do? I said, well, there's £10 for you, Dad. And then I'm off around the world. I'm going to buy new homes in London, Paris, New York. I said, what are you going to do with your £10? He said, I think I'll marry a mother. <laughs> I said, marry a mother? You know what that makes me? He said, yeah, and a tight one at that. <laughs> Lisbon today, though. Lisbon's great, isn't it? It's a very advanced city. I didn't realise till today. I was walking along the main strip and I saw this sign. It said, English-speaking doctor. I thought, that's brilliant, we haven't even got one of those at home. <laughs> easy, Jen. I said, how long does it take to get from Gatwick to Glasgow? He said, just a minute, and I thought, that's a lie. I said, a pair of shoes this big cost more than your own, don't they? But I found a really cheap place for children's shoes. Now, keep it amongst us. Bouncy castles. <laughs> You're struggling with that. You don't need glasses, you need a dog, didn't you? you need... <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, 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 Peter Vernon, Vernon, Peter, drop the curtain, drop the curtain. I'm still in, I'm still in there. Have a look, Vernon, I'm still in there, mate. Do you want to have a look, Peter? <laughs> Have a close look, it doesn't matter. Not the guy. Not the guy. Not the guy. Not the guy. Stop the music, Joel. I can't do it. I can't do it. But, uh, but these guys have been fabulous. A big round of applause for Bernard and Peter. What else has happened in the world? Uh, they've just finished a 300 million pound Disneyland in, in China, and they've just realized there's nobody in the country tall enough to go on any of the rides. <laughs> House at home, and my granddad as well at the moment, and my granddad, I've got to be honest, he's not like you guys. He didn't come out and enjoy himself and relax and have a drink. All he does, 24 hours a day, is moan. Moan, moan, moan. The other day we were sitting there, he was going, one pound 80 for a cup of coffee. £2.50 for a slice of cake. I said, well, we didn't invite you around, Grandad. You just showed up. <laughs> he said, your kids call me Spider-Man. Is that because I'm their hero? I said, no, it's because you can't get out of the bath. I've been trying to cheer him up lately, I've got to be honest, I've been trying to cheer him up. Because uh, he's, very, he's very lonely, so I thought I'd buy him a parrot for company. So I bought him this parrot, it wasn't cheap. I phoned him up the next day and said, how was the parrot, Grandad? He said, lovely. The meat just fell off the bone. <laughs> 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 